Hi friends, this is Nagashu. Welcome to my channel, ITBot143. In this tutorial, I will show how to write down a program to print number pattern using functions in Turbo C++. As we know that function is a subprogram of one or more statements that performs a special task when it is called. Functions helps to reduce the program size, makes easy to understand the program, and debugging is easy with using functions. Open Turbo C++. First, I want to show you a message to user to define the number of lines that he want to display by printf. Enter how many lines you want now for user defined input scanf percentage d before this we need to define a variable for the input value int in prior screen Sorry. now in scanf address of that variable now for creating a pattern I want to declare a function including a argument or a parameter. I'm giving the name as pattern intian here and we'll take the value from the user input and pass it to that function. Now we need to define the function. Here, I want to define few variables which will help pull in the pattern program by int ijk int line here in the pattern we can observe number of rows and number of columns before writing a complete program First, I will try to print the first part of this pattern. Here, I don't add spaces. Later, I will do that. So, I'm using a loop for line equal to 1 line less than or equal to n line plus plus this will help in defining the number of rows and after that for j equal to 1 j less than or equal to line J plus plus in first row I have only one element that is one so from the above two loops it will take line equal to one and check with the condition and it will come to J J equal to one it will check with the condition one less than or equal to line that is one 
if it satisfies then it will print the j value in the first row by printf percentage d and j value after printing that in second row we have two elements one and two so first to change the line printf now line will be increased to two and in j it will take j equal to one and it will check the condition and print the value one after that j will be increased to two again it will check the condition then it will print the corresponding j value after completing the second row it will come to the third row and follows the same procedure and it will print all the elements in each row I will keep this in okay now come to here now come to second part of the pattern here we can observe that from the second row we have the same pattern but in the reverse order so to create this i will use for k equal to line minus one and k greater than equal to 1 k minus in first row it will take line equal to 1 and in k loop k value become 1 minus 1 that is k equal to 0 so it will not print any value after that it will take line equal to 2 in k loop k becomes 2 minus 1 that is 1 and it will check the condition k greater than equal to 1 that is 1 greater than equal to 1 if it satisfies it will print the k value by printf percentage d and value of k after this k value will be decreased now k becomes 0 so it will not satisfy the condition and after that it will come to the third row where line equal to 3 again in k loop it will take k equal to 3 minus 1 k will become 2 again it will check the condition 2 greater than equal to 1 if it satisfies it will print the k value that is 2 and after that k value will be decreased and it becomes 1 again it will check the condition and it will print the k value 1 in third row like this this loop will be continued till it satisfies with line less than or equal to n after creating the program code here we need to call the function Now let's run this program once. Before that, we need to compile this by pressing Alt F9 and run. 
here I have six rows okay I got the same pattern one one two one one two three two one one two three four three two one one two three four five four three two one one two three four five six five four three two one one two three four five six five four three two one okay I got the required pattern but without spaces now to create the spaces in first line I have five spaces and in second row I have four spaces and in third row I have three spaces and in fourth row I have two spaces in fifth row I have one space and in sixth row I don't have any space so I can write a code in the following way for i equal to 1 and i less than or equal to n minus line and i plus plus after that printf so in first line it will take line equal to 1 and here it will take i equal to 1 and in condition it becomes 1 less than or equal to 6 minus 1 that is 5 if it satisfies it will give the spaces in first row by printf okay again in second line it will take line equal to 2 and it will come to i pot and it will i value increase it to 2 and it will check the condition and it will give the spaces in second row similarly this process will continue till the last row after completing the programming code before running this program we need to compile this by pressing alt f9 okay I got zero warnings and zero errors after that come to file save this now let's run this program how many lines you want six lines and I got same pattern one one two one one two three two one one two three four three two one one two three four five four three two one one two three four five six Five four three two one. So like this, we can write a program to print the number pattern by using functions in Turbo C++. I hope this video will help in your practice. If you like this video, please click on like button and please share this video with your friends. And please visit my channel ITBot143 to watch more latest updated videos. And don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you, friends. Have a nice day.